Hi there, Mark Kingsnorth here. I'm just going to show you a new feature I've just introduced into the plating generator add-on for Blender. Um, this will allow you to create um, new um, plates that are separate from the main object. So this will support a more non-destructive workflow. So I'll just show you the way it usually works. So I've, I've kept that way as the default and this is a new feature. So um, what, what it will do um, essentially here on a cylinder with the quads face, faces selected um, will be to uh, create a plating pattern uh, you can um, uh, just create uh, different effects like varying the heights of the different plates to just quickly give you uh, some move like that um, and you can change the random seed um, uh, but the problem before with it was that um, uh, this was all done on the existing mesh so uh, it's not as um, it's not as non-destructive as it could be. Um, uh, it, I would love to add it as a modifier, but um, uh, Blender's uh, application interface doesn't support that quite yet. Um, uh, but um, but hopefully by um, having the option to uh, create the plate separate from the main object very quickly, uh, this will um, stop you having to go back and um, it, any make uh, changes which are quite difficult to change once you've. Uh, made this effect. So here we go. I've just undone everything and now I'm going to select um, the same feature but it says create new object on it. So you might see in the top right hand corner it's actually created a new um, object just of the plate effect um, on top. And I'm just doing the same effect and just varying the heights there just to, just to give an interesting effect um, quite quickly. Um, uh, and uh, you'll, you'll see that this is now a separate object to the original object uh, and I'll just move it around there so you can uh, see that there the cylinder that I selected um, uh, remains intact um, so if you didn't like this effect you want to go back and change it you could just simply delete that um, object and uh, start over again so uh, and that's uh, just a new feature um, uh, some additional features I'm going to be adding soon. Um, I'm definitely going to add some um, library functionality to the greetables that are added. Um, uh, so uh, I'll uh, make a video about that next um, uh, when it's done. Okay, take care. Bye.